what is going on guys thank you guys for joining in here with that being said i want to break down a couple of trades that we made today and i also want to go over what i am looking at for tomorrow with that being said let's jump right into the intro Yo. Getting dirty money hey guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. I'm always I'm putting out at least one video a week, giving you guys absolutely free content that's gonna help you guys, whether it's long term, short term, just in finance, and and everything like that. So with that being said, let's jump back to the video. What's going on, guys? Um, today you guys see these lines on Tesla. That is where we bought and where we sold. I think this was an absolute just great trade by me and my students. Um, again, we used the strategy. This is where I entered the starting line. This is where I sold. Yes, I did sell near the top. No, I did not get the top. I did have a couple of students that just made absolute huge gains here. Um, big congrats to those guys. Um, but that's other than that, I do think Tesla is going to be another one to watch tomorrow. And again, guys, if you guys are wanting to be able to day trade options, I think Spy, Tesla, Apple, Amazon, those are the ones that you guys should be trading. And that's about it. I wouldn't be trading all these others. There are a few others, of course, that when they get moving that they can play very, very well. Um, the one that I did take on this swing trade... It's TLT. I am holding puts right now. You guys can see where I entered up here at. You guys know I always mark these with the dotted line here with the price. Um, so yeah, I am up. I am up decently here on this one. Not nothing to really brag about. The thing that I really want to talk about is Zoom. I did not enter Zoom. It was on yesterday's watch list. If you guys did watch that, it had a huge spike today out of nowhere. Um, that's okay. Again, that's why I really didn't enter. Maybe I should have entered and bought puts up here near the top or even up here when it started to kind of top out a little bit. And I wouldn't be down very much going into tomorrow. I did not. Not going to lie to you guys. So again, when it comes down to this one, this is one I'm still looking to. I just want to see how far I can run. Maybe I was wrong on it and I just don't need to take a position on this one. Um, the other one is I want to talk about is SPY. SPY has been absolutely nuts lately. I mean, you just see this huge crank up in the morning, midday, and then it, just, it looks honestly just like Amazon. If you guys ever trade Amazon, you guys will know that it runs up, and then all of a sudden we just fall for the rest of the day. So did Tesla, though. So these are our ones. Um, you guys know I had a $15,000 day today. Um, thank you for everybody that did say something. Um, that was strictly just from this play on Tesla. I had another small play on Tesla in here, but this was my big play. Again, I held it way longer than I normally would have, but it worked out. So with that being said, Amazon, Tesla, Spy, I would add Apple down here, if you, or BA even. Boeing is another one that you can day trade very, very well. Um, it has a very good sense of direction. With that being said, Spy is one right now that has been absolutely everywhere, getting whipsawed up and down. Not something that, you know, as a day trader, you can capitalize on a lot of these swing or a lot of these big swings during the day. Um, I don't want it to be super, super choppy, though, during the day. Um, when it comes down to swing trades, I'm not really looking at a whole lot other than I'm still possibly looking at Spotify puts and I'm still looking at Zoom puts. ZM is a ticker on that. I'm still holding all the others. Um, I am down a little bit on a couple of the other ones, such as AT&T and Verizon and Exxon Mobil. Um, the other one I did take, I believe, is Netflix and I'm not very far down on Netflix. I, I might even be up. I haven't even checked, to be honest with you guys. Yeah, so I'm barely up on this one. Again, nothing dramatic. But, again, we got time still on this one. So I do think that this one will fall slowly. Um, you guys can see I got a good entry on this one. I didn't buy until later in the day. So that did help quite a bit. With that being said, that is tomorrow's watch list. I will not be, you guys know how I work on Fridays. I do not trade a ton. I, again, I've made my profit for the week. I, I've hit my goals for the week. I want to be able to make sure I can take profit and run with it, pay myself. Because again, this is what I do for a living. This is how I get paid. So that's one of those things I got to keep. Um, I, so I will be trading, but I will be trading super, super small. Fridays, I truly believe in making sure if I've already made my money, staying small, playing smart, and following the rules very, very, very strictly, even though you should be doing that every day. With that being said, guys, if you guys have any questions about any of these plays or anything what's going on or what I'm talking about, please leave a comment below. I will respond to you. DM me on Instagram, whatever you want to do, I will respond. Other than that, guys, I will see you guys tomorrow morning if you are one of my students live. If not, I will see you tomorrow or Sunday night on the watch list. See you guys later.